Hey everyone, this is Pauline the Love and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to transfer playlist to watch later. And without further ado, let us now move on to the tutorial. But first, you must have your playlist link ready. This means that you already copied the link of the playlist you want to transfer to your watch later. Here you see me browsing a channel where the playlist I wanted to transfer is located. Let me type in the channel name and search for the playlist. I found the channel and her playlist. Let me click on that. Just to be sure that this is the correct playlist, I click view playlist. In this playlist, she has 39 videos. It is very important to know how many videos the playlist you wanted to copy. I'm gonna tell you why in a minute. On the left hand side, under the title of the playlist, I click the share button. A small box should pop up where you want to share it to. I just click the word copy and click X to close the box. I now have the link so it's time for me to go to my own channel. Make sure you are signed in. This process will not work if you're not signed in. I am now signed in. Welcome back to my channel. On the upper left corner, you see these three small straight lines. Let me click on that. This opens a long panel on the left screen. I click watch later. Now this brings me to my watch later page. There are no videos in this playlist yet. On the search bar at the top, right click and paste the link of the playlist that we just copied. Then press enter. I am now redirected to the original locations of the playlist. I click play all. Once the first video starts playing, you must pause it. So remember, play and then pause, okay? Play and then pause. While the video is on pause or stop playing, I still check the total number of the playlist. In this case, it has 39 videos. Then I scroll down at the bottom where you can see the suggested videos. Now pick just one of these videos not related to the playlist. Make sure you remember this particular video because we are going to remove it later. Among the suggested videos, I pick the first one on the list. Here you'd see me clicking the three dots on the upper right corner of this particular video. I click those three dots and a small box appeared and I click add to queue. It's now been added to queue. Here you see the title of the playlist has been changed. Previously, the playlist is called Batch 8 Una. Now it's named as Q. Also, the 39 videos is now 40 because we obviously added one video a minute ago. Is that correct? It is now time to transfer this whole playlist to watch later. At the bottom of the title queue, there is a plus sign and save. I click on dot. A small box popped up and I tick the small box of watch later. The playlist has now been added to watch later. Click the three lines again on the upper left corner and click watch later. In watch later page, let's close the player to clear the queue. Ta-da! We now have transferred the playlist to watch later. But wait! This watch later has 40 videos. Let me remove that one particular video that I added a while ago. It is important to remember how many videos your playlist has. In this case, the original playlist has only 39 videos. And to remove that video, let us browse all the way down and look for that video. It is usually added to the last, so it's easy for us to see it. Just click the three dots 
and remove from watch later. And there it is! Our watch later is now complete and is now ready to play anytime. This tutorial is finished. I hope you learned something new today. If you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to click like and share so we can help new YouTubers to learn how to transfer playlists to watch later. The easy way and the fastest way. This is Belinda Love, spreading love, love, love. Thank you for watching. Long nights, alone, sleeping by myself with no one to hold and nothing. Don't you worry, my friend.